Okay, uh, as you know, this is a skull candle. Uh, it's lit. I'm actually working it at the moment. So I'm going to explain. Uh, we've been here before with a similar looking candle. So it's basically to say that uh, I'm working alongside uh, Citri. That's his uh, sigil. Citri is a spirit from the Ars Goetia and... Sorry, I'm actually blowing cigarette smoke on this. You probably can't see it. Uh, I'm doing that because I want to conceal myself. Uh, we don't want the target to know that, you know, there's head work going on. So, uh, actually, I'm going to put the cigarette out for a moment. Because I don't want a fire. Okay. Uh, yeah, Sutri, because Sutri is a, a lost demon. And we're working on the head. So what I'll be doing is uh, blowing the smoke and turning clockwise. That will sit underneath as well. So I've got the guy's picture underneath this candle and I'm turning it clockwise west stating you will find Jane Doe attractive. She is the woman for you. You will be thinking about her non-stop. You will have lustful dreams of her. When you see her, all you can think about is lust. You want her, you want her badly. You could use a red candle as well. I just didn't have any red ones at hand, but it does not matter. At the end of the day, the candle is the focal point. And I also, I should say, I've rubbed some cinnamon powder, some uh, lost powder, and I make all these powders myself. So cinnamon powder, uh, lost powder, uh, ginger, all you know, all of the, the little bits and pieces that relate to, to lust and love because uh, the lady wants lust, uh, excuse me, love as well. I've put across the forehead, uh, I've scratched it in, I've etched it, uh, her first name on the forehead so that that's all he thinks of. So I'll be, like I said, turning clockwise. If it's a black candle, a black skull candle for negative thinking, I turn it anti-clockwise, but this one goes clockwise. The citrus, uh sigil underneath as well because we want Citri's influence because he's a lust demon and he uh, if you want any more information his N uh, or whatever just google uh, Prince Citri uh, the lesser key of Solomon and I'm sure you'll find his details I could uh, go into detail you know here but the moment I just want to explain this so I've scratched all over this candle uh, the petition and I'm I'll be uh, lighting that cigarette up I hate cigarettes I really don't like smoking, but it's, <clears throat> excuse me, I prefer actually to blow cigar smoke. I don't smoke at all, but uh, I just prefer doing that because incense uh, goes from my throat as well. So out of all of the, <laughs> the cigarettes uh, or cigars, they're best of a bad bunch for me. So anyway, so just turn clockwise whilst blowing, making the petition or making the suggestions, should I say. So you will, you know, you will dream of me. You will think of me. I am all you can think of. Only me. And you want to be with me. I am the only one you want to be sexual with. You know, just put your, make it your own. You could also use that with a red vagina candle. Uh, if you're a, a man and you want a lot of females, a red vagina candle. For a woman, it would be a red uh, penis candle rub some honey in there i've also got honey on this not too much because the candle won't light uh yeah and i've just blow <laughs> i've just blown that out it doesn't matter because i think i'm going to restart the spell anyway uh i never like to do too much work on camera because uh, this is all very private so so that's head work with the aid of citri so I think Citri would be, you know, he's the best one for this kind of working to sway the guy into lustful thoughts. And I could also, uh, if we're going to keep it in Goetia, could bring Salos into the equation. Uh, yeah, I'll probably get the Salos sigil and we can work on the relationship via Salos. I'm going to pull cards on this <clears throat> before I go. <clears throat> so one moment. Okay, uh, looking at a few Lenormand cards. Okay, so I've got the key sitting beside the cross. Then I've got the tree 
and the paths or the crossroads. Key card is the heart, which is good. Key cross. Basically, this man is a key to your suffering. That's the way I would read that. He's the reason why you are upset. He's the reason why you're not living a life, uh, a fulfilled life, if you know what I mean. Uh, so he's the reason. He's the reason why you haven't progressed on past uh, your blockages, uh, if that makes sense. I think he is the main issue. So over here, uh, in order to settle on the tree, I've got the crossroads. He needs to make a choice. I think down the line, he will make that choice. I think you will be the one that will come out on top because your key card is um, the heart. And that's a good card for love. Uh, so I think you will find you will find love. It will happen with him. I just think uh, at the moment, there's a bit of... Uh, I call these soul growth lessons. I think we have to go through these soul growth lessons in order to come out the other end and be uh, full, not fulfilled, but be that rounder person. And when you do reunite with the person, you will be, a, you know, a better couple. You don't want to go back into the same uh, misery. You know, when you, you move forward, you have to move forward and into a new future, not into the old past, if that makes sense. So that's what these cards are telling me, that in order to get past the suffering, um, a decision will be made and it, it will be good. So time frames, it's just so hard to predict. You can't predict these things. I did look at a few uh, Oracle cards and I got the barrier. So that sort of rings true. And we got wisdom, a friend. So I'm sure these cards resonate with you more than uh, me because I'm not really sure at the moment. Uh, well, brown haired man. <laughs> and then we've got a brown haired woman. So that sort of uh, sounds like both of you. Uh, and then we've got surprise, generosity. Followed by ah uh, growth. That's actually what we were just talking about. So I think with time, give it a bit of time, uh, a bit of patience. I think things will, you know, come through. Uh, it's always difficult. I understand that, especially when you do this kind of work, uh, because you're sitting and you're waiting, and you wanting to see what's going to happen as a result of the spell. But just sometimes it takes, it just takes time. It can take a few attempts, uh, you know. I'm going to put up another video uh, uh, very, very soon about uh, my s stroke on love spells and what I truly, truly, truly need to put out uh, for people because a lot of people are coming to me and they're very blind with regards to what they're getting into. So I need to do that. So leave it with me and I'm going to work your skull candle and get that going for a few more. I'm actually doing that in the morning because uh, of your location. And uh, we can see how things go. So do keep in touch and let me know. For anyone else, it's thehouseofmagic at gmail.com or I can find you in the comments section if you leave a question i will update my comments section very soon apologies for the delay uh so i'll speak to everyone again soon good night